report of a very interesting event that took place in Kurk. Bharata Vidya Bhavan Kurugu Vidya Lea School conducted an Avalokan Science Fair where students displayed their creativity and talent. The event was inaugurated by the Honorable Minister Sri Suresh Kumar of Primary and Secondary Education. Here are some visuals. by sharing a few thoughts about why education is important and how technology should be used. Experiment maadi in the hell is it? You do not maadi the experiment to, nan mele shale or maadi the experiment to. Also, he encouraged students to come up with fun and interactive ideas by inaugurating the drag race. Thank you, sir. The day kick started with some exciting projects and thrilling activities. We have Dabaina here to give us more details. Over to you, Dabaina. Good morning and hi. I'm standing here in Bharatiya Vidya Bhavan, Kodugu Vidya Alia. First time ever held the science fair, named Avalokit. Here I am, standing at the QTPI race track. Let's go forward and look what is going on. The drag race was one of the events that the students held. They even to build their very own racetrack. The racetrack has lots of hurdles for them to make it difficult. So here at the final, we have the ramps. And through the ramps, we get to know who is the winner. They also built a soccer board and a push ball pit to keep students and visitors entertained and engrossed. Competitions were conducted and to keep the students engaged all day. Uh, can you explain what this is? Uh, so this is a soccer board. Uh, it has been organized by the students of Bharatiya Vidya Bhavan Kodugu Vidyalaya. So the game is played by two people, uh, Team Red and Team Blue. Uh, whoever, sco whoever scores uh, the most points wins the game. And this game has been coordinated and organized by seven standards. Can you tell me what this game is all about? This game is football. And this, this has two parts. Which, which is controlled by an Android phone. In one minute, who will put first ball to, to that player? They are the winner. Apart from competitions, students also came up with innovative ideas and built projects such as automating their classroom lights, building an elephant invasion security system, and many more that would address local problems. Here are some visuals. We have the Minister of Primary and Secondary Education, Mr. Suresh Kumar, who shares his thoughts on the whole event by saying he had a great experience and was thrilled with the students' creativity and problem-solving skills. We also have a few parents who share their thoughts. We were young kids. We didn't have any idea of this uh, robotics. This robotics is really good because this is a future thing. The children have understood the concept. Now what I'm saying is the higher authorities, you know, like the government, they should adopt this instead of wasting our resources, they can really implement. Be careful. Otherwise, what will happen is when we are driving, suddenly we will end up, you know, in front of an elephant. Instead, if there is a sensor like this, we know that, okay, elephant has entered, be careful. So that is really going to help. Overall, it was one exciting day for both the visitors and the students. This is the Baina reporting for QT News. Thank you, the Baina, for the report. That's all for today. For more updates on the latest events, Keep watching QT News. This is Joanna signing off.